Greetings and Namaste. This is Shiva, your friendly neighborhood wellness guide coming at you from Minneapolis, Minnesota. My mission is wellness for all. So today's subject that came to me as I woke up in the morning was around diet. And as some of you might know from previous explorations with Ayurveda or maybe having seen a previous video of mine, diet is one of the three pillars of Ayurveda. Trayopstham. So what does what does diet mean? Is it simply having nutritious food? Is it simply having food that is appropriate for our mind-body constitution, for our prakriti, our fullest, highest inborn potential? Or is it a little more than that? So I believe Ayurveda has come through a lineage of several enlightened souls, sages, practitioners, and of course, the validation of life as a whole. Because as you can imagine, in science, when an experiment is successful, you want to broaden the scale to see if it still scales up. And Ayurveda is no different. You know, if, if a certain herbal remedy, for example, works for a certain condition, for a certain person, for how it came about, how that disease manifested in the first place, does it work pretty much consistently across, you know, countries, continents, races, stages of life, etc. So that's when you start to come to more of the universally applicable rules. So maybe what I'll do is I'll make today's series about eating. So diet aside, let's let's focus on the process of eating. And I think I'm going to chunk it into three phases just to keep it simple and easily digestible. Um, digestion is a, again um, like a base principle of Ayurveda. If, if you can digest effectively all of your life experiences, not just your food, not just the air you breathe, not just the relationships you have, you're probably going to be in, in better shape than, than most. So let's, let's maybe tee off with the first phase of the eating process. I'll give you a minute to maybe just think, not a minute, that'll be too long, but you know, a metaphorical minute to think about what that first phase might be. And as we develop this understanding together, you know, the process can evolve as well. So the first phase, according to me, would really be 